received a script, and the uh, renowned Abby Mann had written it. Well, very well-known writer. And Judgment at Nuremberg. Uh, Carl Malden, who's a fabulous actor, was going to play my husband. And I met with the uh, Abby Mann, and um, I'm trying to remember when I first met Carl Malden. I think it was probably in uh, in the office, uh, and, and uh, short, the day after uh, that, I do remember it. The day after, I was shopping at uh, my neighborhood market, and I had come from swimming or something, and my hair was wild and curly. And suddenly I saw Carl Malden pushing a basket with his wife. It turned out to be his wife. Oh, I can't let him. He'll think I've transformed and I'm not the person they thought they liked. I hid myself in the market. Abby Mann wrote some of the scripts, and he hired other good writers to write some of them. And they were all of different lengths, sometimes an hour, sometimes two hours. Um, and they would put them on at different times. So no one knew when, when to look for it. So an audience gets lost when you do that too many times. I think they didn't know what to do with my character. And uh, Abby Mann decided that he didn't like the way I looked. <laughs> and, uh, uh, you know, he had met with me a number of times before we started to shoot, and he decided I looked too young, that my hair looked too nice and clean, and um, he made a, a scene on the set. I had fortunately gotten to the point in my life where I could handle it. <laughs> 